Tim Berners-Lee by Joey Anderson. Tim Berners-Lee was born June 8th, 1955. As he was growing up, Berners-Lee's parents worked on the first ever commercially based computers in London, England. He went on to graduate from Oxford with a degree in physics. After receiving his degree, Berners-Lee eventually wound up at CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research. Early on, he proposed a system of organizing information called hypertext. He would return to CERN years later after working for another company gaining computer networking experience. In 1989, CERN was the largest internet hub in all of Europe. By the 70s and 80s, the internet was widely used by scientists and scholars. Scientists were using it to send information back and forth using emails using only text. Hypertext created a system of linked files that could be located on computers around the globe forming the now www.worldwideweb. With this proposal came with text, images, and later audio and video. Berners-Lee and his co-creators had come up with a shared language to operate on. They called it Hypertext Markup Language, or HTML. They also needed to create a shared way to, for personal users to let the web know what they wanted, and the URL was born. This was a critical addition because the URL could access older internet sources which helped the web become user-friendly and stay up-to-date with the past, present, and future. In December 1990, CERN launched its initial version of the web and it became an instant hit. The only thing holding the invention back was widespread access to the internet, which was made possible by the late 1990s. This adaption changed communication history because it represented a combination of networking and personal computing. Berners Lee said the creation was made out of an act of desperation, but without this creativity and desire to make the internet better, it wouldn't have been made possible.